President Muhammadu Buhari has appointed the federal government's team to engage Twitter over the suspension of its operations in the country. Minister of Information and Culture Alaji Lai Mohamed Wuwi chaired the team made the announcement in a statement on Tuesday. The team comprises the Attorney General of the Federation and Honorable Minister of Justice Abubakar Malami, Honorable Minister of Communication and Digital Economy Isa Pantami, Honorable Minister of Foreign Affairs Geoffrey Oyema, Minister of Works and Housing Babatunde Fashola, Minister of State for Labor and Employment Chris Ngige, and relevant government agencies. Because the Buari led federal government had indefinitely suspended Twitter's operations over activities capable of undermining Nigeria's corporate existence. Twitter had written to the federal government seeking to engage it in a view to charting a path forward. Okay. I, I don't think they should be able to they don't there's no need for them. Now since they've banned it, they don't know this thing. If the man or the Twitter wants to come back, they shouldn't even allow him because they believe that uh, it's, co co it's coming to take a, a make a Nigeria ungovernable for them. And I'm sure it is the same Twitter that is sending S men all over the place. You see how they want to they are always trying to shift blame. I don't even know where um <clears throat> I don't know why Twitter is even writing them because I don't even believe it's anything coming from Lai Mohammed. You know, people have to look at it very, very well. If even himself he knows that even to his children, all of them, his grandchildren, like he said, that they are asking him why are they calling him liar Mohammed. And he could not even give a and a, a, a detailed explanation to his grandson. He said, how can I be explaining this and this and that, that the child might not understand. But the child can understand that uh, you are being called a liar. So all this one, they have been parrying all of this. Is the, what is even paining them is that Twitter did not come and establish uh, its office in Nigeria. You can imagine if they had done that, they would just, they would just be issuing, issuing whatever, whatever. But if Twitter wants to be cowed, that is their own cup of tea. There are other platforms that Nigerians can use which I believe, and now the ECOWAS has ruled against the federal government that you cannot arrest anybody, you cannot prosecute anybody for using Twitter. So people are still using Twitter, and they should be able to know how to go about it, which they have been doing. So what is the big deal? If Nigeria government feels that uh, it does not have anything to do with Twitter, they should not even accept Twitter, say, whatever. Why are they negotiating with them in the first place? No, there's no need. If you know that you are okay, you are a sovereign city, you just say, no, there's no point. Don't worry. Don't worry. Just, we have banned you, we have banned you, and that is it. <laughs> well, the suspension of Twitter operation in Nigeria is apt and commendable. Such action further strengthens our resolve as an independent nation. Kudos to the government. The negotiation team should equally be uh, nationalistic, robust, and witty in the negotiations all of them oh, they are suffering it oh. all those who are negotiating who want to go and negotiate, they are suffering it what who, 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 who is talking all of them but, but because they, they are always afraid i service that is why all of them are just keeping mom you think they love it they don't like it the negotiation team should be what deep is it the same all this one that they will see oh, you born they will be shaking they will see oh, you born they can't even stand on their own these are the same set of people they are talking about a, a sovereignty and whatever and you will be going to countries to go and be begging them <laughs> Ah, uh, okay now. Nah. Mm. I I agree partly with you. Please remember you can't be irresponsible with your tweets. Even as a leader, Buari was irresponsible in his tweet. You cannot also stifle press and the people you are supposed to be you're supposed to be their leader. Our relationship should be a win win solution. However apt it may be, Twitter um no is no respecter of persons or positions. Our leader should learn to uh, be uh, decorous in their post. They are talking to the people that uh, pit them there, so they should they put them there, so they should show some level of respect to citizens, no matter the region they come from or they are addressing. This is very important. Please, if they must earn the respect of a leader of a sovereign nation, well, someone says Onoche voice has been very quiet. No Twitter available for her to attack and abuse her anti-government nigerians what a period of quietness no noise they are not enjoying this imposed ceasefire ceasefire of course they are not enjoying it now all of them they are not enjoying it well uh, loretta noche's nomination as neck commissioner is still pending at the national assembly she can't even abuse anybody for now don't mind that sabotage but their end is drawing near by the minutes and it shall be disastrous Twitter does not even know 
what they were banned, whether they were banned by Nigeria government because their business is still booming as usual. All these ministers of this and that, chief justice to meet with Twitter for what? Are they minister for communication or the the lawyer of the federal government? God, tell your lawyer uh, to draft uh, what you want and dialogue. Stop displaying illiterate, illiterate and uh, shamelessly. Twitter is a business owned by certain groups. Why sending delegates as if it is a diplomatic affair? Please, only the concerned departments and federal government law, uh, lawyers should go, go, not ministers. How about Nigeria government? Okay, so do you have a government? Pompous Buhari is now tired of Twitter suspension. Which Buhari? The Buhari uh, that is buried in a shallow grave. Where is coal not working? The coup or school, or what do they call it? Somebody is asking whether it is not working. So why are they, like I said, they have other uh, social media platforms they can use. Why? Why Twitter? If you know that you don't, you don't have Twitter, you don't need to Twitter. Why? Why? You, even if they call you, forget it. <clears throat> Buari or Malami, I beg, we, we hear word, I beg. Make we hear word, I beg. Buari does not even know Twitter. Brainless government directing bullets and bomb where, where there is no battle, leaving the main battle feed unharmed. For bandits and S men, and they are, uh, see the way they have exalted Twitter now. Why did they start a battle they knew they would not finish? Why can't someone wake up one day and say something positive about Nigeria? When Nigeria starts being positive, good begets uh, good. Twitter versus federal government one zero. Okay, stories. Negotiate for what? For fundamental human rights. But shh. Twitter shouldn't even listen to them. Who cares if you ban Twitter? The world will move on and leave you big circle behind. Yes, Nigerians will keep using same. You will need to prosecute more than 50 million Nigerians currently and see using Twitter. Uh, okay, more than 50 million and see using Twitter. I suggest you change your team and appoint reasonable non-terroristic nigerians in your cabinet not malami and gaba no liar people are still using it now no way negotiation has long belated here you come again to display your low understanding you thought their strength in power without knowledge you know you want to learn in a hard way when you got busted before you negotiate uh, negotiation on Ecowas court ruling we stand. Don't forget it is only a fool that lean upon his foolish understanding. The suspension show showcase a bad government. Now she wants to settle with Twitter having lost millions of dollars within few weeks. Nigeria miss it all. Imagine a dreaded Boko Haram member is in front a uh, in front front negotiating with Twitter.